So, momentous news. After an interval of 48 years, we are finally returning to the moon. Hopefully. Mankind last left its surface on December the 14th, 1972 at 5.55 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Stage push. Engine arm is out Okay, I'm going to get the pro. 99, proceeded. 3, 2, 1. Ignition. Right away, Houston. That's your good. Excellent. Many people old enough to remember the original landings and the optimism of that era feel a sense of desperate disappointment that we failed to send an astronaut beyond low Earth orbit since then. So for a boomer like me, this was great news. I hope it happens, I really do. I feel as though manned spaceflight has been put on hold for most of my adult life. So how does our wonderful national broadcaster choose to report this? NASA outlines plan for first woman on moon by 2024. That's a plan? To put a woman on the moon? Jesus age Christ. The BBC just can't stop themselves. An attempt to return to the moon after all these years to extend the boundaries of humanity once more. But no, for the BBC, it's all about the women. Whomever NASA chooses for these missions, they should be chosen on merit and merit alone. There are many great women astronauts, but their gender should never be a factor in their selection.